it's literally in that scene. So they're just yeah. throwing the rocks at the bullies, and then that's where I had to turn off. Okay. Yeah. I, I, I will be very interested to hear your synopsis at the end, your review at the end, um, once, yeah. For those of you just joining us, because we started this conversation before we were recording, I started watching It, because Johnny and I talked about horror the other day, and I was like, I realised how many horror movies I've actually seen, and I don't really know what it is about certain horrors. I don't like paranormal stuff that much. Like, that oh, has no interest okay. to me. Slasher stuff doesn't interest me that much. I don't know no. what it is, but like said, uh, when we checked out Meet and Greet, by Ice and Kills, that was like the Hannibal sort of inspiration thing. I was like, oh, yeah, I've seen all those movies. I really like them because they're really interesting and well-written and cool story and they're well-acted. And then I was like, oh, I've actually realised I've seen more of these. So I was like, mm. I'm just going to start watching it so that I can say to Johnny I've done it. <laughs> and about an hour in to the first of the two. So we'll... I'm very proud of him. I'm very proud of him. Uh, anyway, we're going to check out a band that you, if you are an international viewer, may have never heard of. The band is an Aussie band from up north in sunny Queensland called Sunk Loto. This is their brand new track, The Gallows Wait. So the band had <clears throat> made massive waves in the scene uh, and then they disbanded, um, what was it, like 20, 20 years, years ago? ago? Yeah. And they decided they would get back together and they would do some reunion shows for a little bit of fun. The show is all sold out. Uh, they're going on another tour, which has all sold out. And they've dropped their first new tune, albeit without their original guitarist, who um, I believe they let go recently. Was there um, a reason? There was stuff that they posted on social media. There was an explanation about him being not a very kind person. Um, yeah, but I think we're going to the shows, and I would love to chat to the guys. When are the shows? Um, soon. Every show is fucking soon now. Yeah. But anyway, I'm interested to see what style they've gone for. They were kind of metal meets new metal meets metal core meets sort of proggy moments. So I'm interested to see what they do now because it's been 20 years since they've written anything. When we interviewed... Was it Jason? Is that a name? I don't yeah, know Jason, I and, Jason and Dane. Great. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Didn't make that up. When we interviewed them, I had said that I... Well, it's right there on the screen. Uh, I had I'd missed them. I, so I was just too young to get this. 20 years ago, I was too young to be really... I've gone into them and I wasn't into that scene yet. So I never, ever listened to them. I've now listened to some of them where Johnny has played me and been like, this is a song you should check out and this. And I really liked it, but it's not, not a band I'm super familiar with still. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, if you're an international viewer, you probably don't know them because no one's as old as Johnny. That's... I will say, though, um, Jason is one of the best live vocalists I've ever heard. He has a phenomenal voice, phenomenal tone. I was so blown away by the fact he still had such ferocious screams and such a... Just a really great singing voice. I won't say beautiful, but it is beautiful. You're beautiful. Fuck. Three, two, one. <clears throat> oh. One way trip to Riff City. Fuck yeah. Sick. Uh, guitar work is fucking sick. Mm. I don't know if New Guitarist Man wrote that, but holy shit, that's fun. What do you think about this film clip? Gives me... Tool vibes. Remember the old Tool music videos? Yeah. Uh, Gives me saw vibes. Yeah, that too. The hat doesn't look comfortable. No, no it doesn't. <laughs> uh, also, his voice is sounding great. Oh, I 
fucking love his tone. Get some shred too. Someone called a ninja turtle. Oh. Ho, ho. Yeah, Disney guitar sounds sick. So sick. Fucking boy has some range. Mm. Is that one vocalist? Yeah. That's another thing that I always loved about him. <clears throat> he was a singer screamer and So what about where you had the back and Oh back well and forth bit? so the guitarist used to do like so I'm assuming the new guy can or maybe the bass player will do it. He used to do like high harmonies and some other like you know, counter screams and things like that. Sure. Um so not, when I saw them none of that was missing live. But yeah, his voice is just Oh, I'm, I'm so glad they're back because he has one of my favourite voices to ever come out of this country. It's just got such a cool tone. That was a really cool song. I think that all the instruments were given their space. Mm. The drum was open enough to let that guitar kind of drive through the whole way in, but still hit when it kicked into that chorus. Cool yeah. breakdown. It said the vocals were great. The guitar was fantastic. That was a really cool film clip too. Yeah, I liked it. Yeah. It definitely had that sort of saw, but like um, like a modern style of those tool music videos that used to be kind of like claymation. Yeah, remember those? Yeah, um, I like there was a a continue. Like it took a little bit for you to get the story because it's like what's happening to start with. Yes, yeah. oh, everyone's dead, and then it's as it goes on and on and on and on. Then you're like, oh, okay, now that's yeah. what's happening. It's it's really interesting. Yeah, it's good. Uh, it's also interesting to me <clears throat> when. So we spoke to them when we chatted with them. Feel free to go and check it out. Uh, when we spoke to them, they talked about being gone for 20 years and then coming into this this new world now where there's things like reaction videos that didn't exist. Yeah. And your reach could potentially be so much greater than it ever was before. Yeah. Um, it's interesting for me that they didn't do like a live performance or have themselves in the video to familiarise themselves maybe they're everyone? trying to get a young audience and they don't want to show how old they are they don't look old no they didn't but <laughs> they look younger than us i mean younger than me <laughs> uh they're my age i think too. you're fine jared leto said that you look younger than i do yeah you jerk jared leto so we know now that jared leto does drugs <laughs> <laughs> anyway what um, did you guys think yeah. of the gallows weight if you haven't checked out sunk lotto 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 I always call it Lotto, but is it Lotto? I think it's Lotto, because remember how we've got the, the Lotto here, like the lottery, it's L-O-T-T-O. -T yeah. The double T makes the short noise. Okay, sunk Lotto. 
yeah, go and do a bit of a deep dive. Mm. I strongly recommend the last album they did, Between Birth and Death. It's it's great. Uh, this is definitely a little bit different, though. This has definitely got a much more modern and current spin on it, mm. for sure. I really enjoyed that. That was cool. I'm sick. Thanks, Thanks for watching. watching you. We'll see you guys next time.